We're heading into the opposite dimension in Minecraft, and I am truly terrified. Hello everybody, I am Kindly Kid, and welcome back to Minecraft. We've been having some fun with some weird mods in Minecraft, and today I bring you yet another strange and terrifying mod. It's called Opposite Dimensions, and things are very different in the opposite dimension, but first, we have to get there. And in order to get there, you need to build a, a opposite dimension portal or something. I don't know. I'm in creative mode to make this process as easy as possible so that we can get to the opposite dimension as quickly as possible. Although it'll probably still take me a while. First things first, we need to make mirrors. To make mirrors, you need glass. Okay, I, I gotta give myself more glass than that. I don't know how much exactly I need. Probably like 10 stacks, I don't know. You need a lot. Basically, we're building a nether portal, but out of the materials that are specifically for this mod. If I need more glass, I can just give myself more glass. It's creative mode. So let's just start with that. Then we need iron. I think in total we need 10 mirror blocks. And I don't feel like doing the math. So I'm just gonna give myself 10 iron ingots. It's probably good enough. And again, if it's not, we're in creative. I'm even gonna give myself a crafting table because I'm so lazy, I don't even wanna punch trees. Okay, crafting table. Now. Let's see if this recipe works. We make a square of glass and then we put the ingot in the middle. That's a mirror. There you go, we've done it. Now we need 10 of those. Or do we need 14? Let's start with 10 and go from there, shall we? I don't know if I'm gonna have enough glass. I might have to give myself more. Oh wait, but I only need to make 10 at, or nine at this point. Uh, well, my bad. Oh well, let's, let's just make nine glass blocks or mirror blocks and then that should be good for now so now we need to build the portal and it's the same shape as a nether portal although i need blocks to place the corners and then we just go three up and then we place another glass block and then we put two here and then we put three here and also i just realized that because i'm in creative the blocks that I created don't actually disappear when I use them. Lesson learned. But now things get even weirder. We need a furnace. And then we need a flint and steel. And what are we going to do with a furnace and a flint and steel? We're going to cook the flint and steel. I need coal. <laughs> Obviously, I'm very prepared. And as you can see, our flint and steel is cooking. Into what, you might ask? Well, obviously, it's an upside down flint and steel. Or rather, a steel and flint. Very different. And these are the items that we require in order to access the opposite dimension. Now, before we go into the opposite dimension, well, first, we should probably light the portal. Please work. Yes! Oh my gosh, okay. Before we go into the opposite dimension, I'm going to give myself some better gear, and then I'm going to go back into survival mode, which is very scary for me, but we're going into the opposite dimension, and we're going to try to survive and explore. Okay, I have diamond armor, I have diamond gear, and I have a whole bunch of steak. Now let's set the game mode back to survival, and let's step into the opposite dimension. I have no idea what this is going to be like, but let's experience it together. <laughs> oh, gosh. Okay. <laughs> what? The ground is blue. How strange. Oh gosh. Oh, are the trees upside down? Of course the trees are upside down. It's opposite world. The ground is blue. The sky is green. Actually, the sky isn't really green. Hello, Mr. Cow. How are, how are you doing? Hey, Mr. Cow. Oh my gosh. Okay. Yep. That sure. Of course, the friendly farm animals attack you. Of course they do. So I'm going to get murdered by a bunch of pigs and chickens. Oh no. But as I understand it, there are different biomes in opposite land. This is clearly the upside down tree blue biome. So if animals are mean and want to kill me, does that mean that other mobs want to be my friends? I sure hope so. Oh my gosh. He's holding a flower. 
you guys. And he's coming straight to me. Wait, are you my friend? Ah, you still hurt me! How did you betray me like that? You were carrying me- Oh, you blew up! That was not a creeper and it blew up. Oh gosh, okay. So, did certain mobs blow up? Sure, of course. Yeah, that makes sense! That chicken's throwing eggs at me! No! Bad throwing egg chicken! Stop it! Stop! Please, please! Oh my gosh. Okay, chickens are probably the most terrifying creatures I've ever experienced. I'm leaving. I'm leaving and I'm eating my steak and you can't stop me. Oh my goodness. This chicken is going to murder me. I can't, they, they throw their eggs so fast. Please, Mr. Chicken. Oh, my heart is racing from a murderous chicken. Yeah, cow, you back off, dude. You back off. I do not like this world. Are the cows dropping rotten flesh? Disgusting. Also, like, do, do different things drop different stuff? Like, if I chop down a tree, what do I get from the tree? Do I, I still get wood? Okay, they're just upside down trees. They're not something else. Ah, back off! Why are all these friendly, delicious animals trying to kill me? It's supposed to be the complete opposite. I'm supposed to be eating them and they're trying to eat me. But let's try to find some different biomes, shall we? We could also do some digging. I have a pickaxe. Wait, is that a, is that a village over there? Okay, there's a village. I gotta know what's going on in the village. Oh my gosh, there's a chicken. Please, don't look at me. Chickens are truly the most terrifying creatures that we've <laughs> experienced. Skeleton is smiling. They're so happy. All the skeletons are happy, but they are still attacking me. They still shoot arrows, which is very not cool. I don't love that. I wish that they were my friends. Now, where was that village? I think it was over here somewhere, right? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, now I am a little bit worried. Do you think the villagers are going to try to kill me? Wait a second. These houses are upside down. <laughs> These houses are totally upside down, aren't they? Oh, man. This is so bizarre. Hello, Mr. Skeleton. Maybe this is, I don't know, Skeleton Town or Chicken Town. Oh, my gosh. I have to kill this chicken. Please. Whoa, this is the final boss. Oh, my gosh. I can't. You cannot defeat chickens. They are far too strong. <laughs> they throw eggs too fast. Please. You can see these eggs flying, zipping past my head. Gosh, no. And now, now there's an angry pig. Now I'm being chased by an angry pig, please. I, I just, I need to eat my steaks. They're finally getting their revenge. I am walking around with like 50 pieces of, you know, cow. I guess I kind of understand why they're so mad. So that town was a nightmare. No villagers, but lots of chickens. Shall we do some digging? I mean, I guess, like, it would be kind of cool if we found an opposite dimension mine, right? Let's dig down. Let's, let's see if we find anything down there. Uh, I might need to turn my brightness up. Although, do you think being in the opposite dimension, when you go underground, it actually gets brighter? It kind of feels like that right now. Which is awesome, but also very strange. Oh, okay. We found an opening. I'm a little scared about dropping down, but let's go for it. Um, okay, I guess we'll go deeper. <laughs> I'm very, very scared. I mean, to be honest, underground of opposite dimension doesn't seem all that different. Do you think this is actually coal? It's, yeah, this is actual coal. Okay, and look, we found some iron. Look at us. We're doing Minecraft stuff. We're Minecrafty. I hear something. I think I hear water. Yeah, there's there's water around here. I really do appreciate that the mines are nice and bright. Who needs torches when you live in opposite dimension? Oh, we're getting closer to the water. Oh, here you go. Oh, we found a ravine. Okay. I mean, to be honest with you, this looks a lot like a ravine in normal. Not opposite dimension. There is a flower just randomly growing down here, which typically don't see in ravines. Of course, there's lava. Shall we go further down? I, I guess, I mean, wait, we found some gold. Let's collect it, because, I mean, it's Minecraft. It's kind of what you do. 
Oh, there's an angry pig in this mine. No. Oh, it's an exploding pig. Why? Why? Oh my goodness. Now it makes me wonder what creepers do. Do you think they drop ham? Oh, this is not a place that you typically want to be. I mean, there's some great resources around here for sure, but also like, might die. <laughs> Let's get out of here. I am very lost, but that's okay. Follow the water. Maybe, maybe this will get us back to the surface. Oh gosh, it's gonna take so long. Hey, we made it back to the ravine. Okay, but how do we get out? I guess we build. We have materials. Also, we have arrows stuck in our body. Let's go up. Am I almost there? Almost there. Oh, I hear an angry cow. Oh, there's a chicken as well. Oh gosh. No, 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 no. Bad, bad, bad chicken. Okay. You, you. I must get revenge for all the angry chickens. Gosh, no, no. I'm gonna die. There's, I'm, I don't think I'm gonna survive this chicken onslaught. No! <laughs> Kian was shot by angry clucker. It's a perfect name. They are very angry. Okay, you know what? We're going back to creative mode. It's too scary. It's too scary to be in survival mode. But this also allows us to obviously explore more of the world very quickly. So let's do exactly that. Let's try to find some other biomes. We're like in blue upside down tree biome, but I would love to find something else. I'm never gonna see cows and chickens the same again. This mod has ruined my Minecraft experience. So I've been traveling in this straight line for a very long time. And I'm seeing a whole lot of blue. I'm really hoping that we can find a different biome. Tell you what, I've been doing this for a long time. I'm gonna generate a new map and try again. See if we can find some different biomes. So I created a brand new world, teleported into the opposite dimension, and uh, lo and behold, I see a lot of blue. So I've desperately tried so many different methods to get other biomes to show up in this mod and I cannot find the other biomes. I've created new worlds. I did a world with large biomes. I tried installing a different version of the mod. I tried installing a different version of Forge. I am losing my mind. I cannot find other biomes other than upside down blue tree land. And it's very frustrating. But I did read somewhere that you can tame cows just like you tame wolves. And I don't know if you use a bone to do that, but oh, maybe I have to be in survival mode or maybe you give them wheat. You know what? Let's try that before I do anything crazy. Cows love wheat, right? Take it, take it. What? You don't want it? Okay, fine. So here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna give myself a whole bunch of wheat and I'm gonna give myself a whole bunch of bones just in case cows get tamed by eating bones. And then we're gonna go into survival mode and I'm probably gonna die like really fast. Here, here, have this, have it. No, no, that's not what I meant. No, take the bone, take it. No, they don't want it. It's not fooling them. It's not fooling them. They're still very angry, why? Why? I just want you to be my friend. Fine. Then I will destroy you with the bone that I once offered as a sign of our friendship. But instead, I will kill you with it. Oh gosh, okay. These guys are kind of tough. Yeah, who would have thought cows are this tough? Oh my gosh. Okay, these are very angry and very strong cows. Please. Oh, the pig just blew up. Okay, yeah, I'm... <laughs> I was killed by a moo, I kill you. There you go. Opposite dimensions.